Hi there, Jude here. Uh, wanted to give you a bit of a, an update. Uh, summer at STJ, uh, looking a bit further forward, various socials and events coming up. Change to our Sunday school uh, provision, a little bit of an update on the building as well. All sorts of stuff coming up uh, over the next few weeks. Um, you should get reminders about this stuff uh, via Friday news uh, and on Sundays as well. But uh, now is a good moment to, uh, to put things uh, in the diary. So maybe if you've got your phone handy or grab your diary, uh, just a few dates and stuff uh, to pop in um, uh, if you can. So uh, what's coming up? Well, uh, this Saturday, Saturday the 19th of June, um, we've got a, uh, a trip, whole church trip to uh, Crosby Beach meeting at Burbo Bank uh, from 10.30 on the Saturday morning. A bit of a walk, there'll be some beach games. Uh, come at any point really, I mean we'll be there for a few hours I'm sure, so if 10.30 on the dot doesn't quite work, just drop in uh, a phone, come and find us. Uh, but it will be a great time, I'm sure. Uh, Sunday the 20th uh, of June, so this coming Sunday, uh, we're joining in with some other churches uh, across Toxteth, doing some uh, leaflet dropping and sort of advertising what's going on with local uh, churches. So um, we'd love it if a few folks could come and join for that. Uh, you can sign up via the Friday News uh, link or just come and, and, and have lunch uh, at ours after the Sunday service. Uh, join in with the leaflet drop. It's a chance to sort of have a walk and to have a pray as well around the local area. So um, uh, do uh, drop in for that this Sunday if you can uh, too. Uh, the following Saturday, Saturday the 26th of June, uh, we've got our, the ordination services in the cathedral. So excited uh, for Jenny and of course for Michelle as well, uh, both of whom are getting ordained uh, on that Saturday. Uh, the services will be streamed from the cathedral um, about 1.30ish I think. Um, but you know, so exciting for them as they join uh, the team. Um, and then the Sunday after, so Sunday the 27th of, uh, of June, um, instead of the, the normal morning service, we're going to go for a, a church trip out to West Kirby uh, on the Wirral. Um, easy to get there by train or by car. I think quite a few of us are going to go by train. It's a train at 10.37 or something from um, Liverpool Central. Um, getting to West Kirby for about uh, 11.15, uh, there or thereabouts. Um, Again, great opportunity to hang out, just to be together. We'll go for a stroll uh, down the rural way, probably get to Thurstestern, a bit of uh, playing on the beach, again, just being together. Um, uh, bring a packed lunch, I think, uh, for that. Or fish and chips, maybe, on, on the way back, something like that. Um, but that's uh, the Sunday morning. And then um, uh, we're going to be, make sure we're going to be back in Liverpool for sort of 2, 2.30ish on the Sunday. And there is a four o'clock service on Sunday, the 27th of June. Uh, two. And, and at that service there's going to be two, well, there's going to be one infants group, there's going to be a juniors group and a seniors group, so three groups on the Sunday. Um, uh, and a great chance as well, just in the service, to hear from uh, Jenny and Michelle, to hear about how God's been moving in their lives as they've been preparing to, to be ordained and join the team, just to pray for them as well. So that's um, Sunday the 27th of June. As we move into July, uh, we are aiming to run three uh, sort of infants and juniors groups uh, across the two services on a Sunday, as well as the seniors group at the four o'clock. So more details on that to come, but really just wanting to increase um, our provision there, and make it possible for uh, as many children as possible to, uh, to participate uh, in that. Um, week commencing the 28th of June, so that last week of June into July, uh, we're setting that aside for a week of prayer. Um, and uh, amongst other things, we're going to be uh, we're going to be praying in the mornings, uh, Monday to Friday, uh, in the grounds of the church. So 7:30 to 8:30, uh, Monday to Friday, some open air worship, uh, just chance to pray. Jenny and Michelle will have started that week, of course. So much to pray about uh, at the moment. So, uh, and again, if you don't want to come for the whole hour, drop in for the first half an hour or something. Come at any point through that hour. Just be so good, really, just to pray together, to be together, and to worship together. If you can, if you can factor that into your uh, routine, um, maybe drop off one of those before work or something that week. That would just be so good. So, now a week of prayer uh, from Monday the twenty eighth of June. Um, through July, uh, we're going to be trying to offer some sort of weekly uh, Sunday lunches. Um, come over to number four or number six after the ten thirty service, or come early before the four o'clock. Um, 
generally eating outside if weather uh, permits, but again just a chance to, to connect and chat a bit. Um, and by that point we would have started our summer sermon series, um, which uh, this year is entitled Friendship. So we're looking at, at different friendships uh, in the Bible and what we can learn uh, about the importance of spiritual friendships, you know, how much we need them, uh, how we can offer that uh, in the lives of others. Um, and a bit of a call just to sort of reinvest in our friendships together uh, as a church family. So really excited about how God's going to be speaking uh, through that and just the encouragement uh, that I'm sure that will bring. Um, at the end of July, uh, so gosh we're moving into July, I'm thinking now already, again this is definitely one for the diaries. Um, the last weekend in July, the, the, is it the last week? Yes, I think it's the last full weekend in July, uh, the 23rd to the 25th of July. Um, we're going to join in with the HTB um, Network's Focus Weekend. Uh, really excited for that. There'll be an event on the Friday night. Uh, we're going to have a, a sort of I don't know, 10 till 2, uh, I think it is, uh, sort of family, well, everybody welcome, sort of church event in the park. He was really, really excited about that. Some, some um, uh, different things going on in our services on the 25th. So again, a bit of a sort of staycation-y feel to it, uh, different things happening across the course of the weekend. Um, and then as we move into August, we're going to be doing our usual thing, uh, on a Sunday at least, of, uh, of, of reducing our sort of rhythm to one service on a Sunday. So we'll alternate between the 10.30 and the 4 o'clock service, uh, and then we'll be doing a, a church picnic uh, to Tatton Park, I think it is, on, on Sunday the 22nd uh, of August. Uh, again, one for the diary. Um, as things stand, uh, we might not be back in the building until October, maybe even late October. I mean, we're, there's possibly one or two delays that we're sort of working with at the moment, just trying to minimise uh, the impact there. But it would be really good for us to be praying uh, as, as a church for a, um, <laughs> for a sort of timely um, completion of the building works. Uh, so excited about what God has for us there as we move back in in the autumn um, but let's pray for, for sort of timely uh, completion. Uh, who knows we might even uh, be looking at some open air services somewhere maybe even under under the tent under the tent perhaps in the grounds of the church uh, back into September into October. Who knows what the Lord has for us um, but do be praying about that uh, if you can. Uh, all sorts of other social stuff uh, happening, coming up over the summer, of course. Some of the connect groups have started to meet physically uh, outside, which is wonderful. Um, we might be trying a bit of open air worship, just exploring that at different points too. Uh, and again, with our sort of friendship sermon series, I think my encouragement to us uh, as a church is let's be, let's be in investing uh, in our friendships uh, together. Talking with each other, exploring these sort of new ways of being church. Um, figuring this stuff out together uh, as we move uh, forward. Um, and it's amazing really because you know, in the last 12 months or so something like about 80 new people have joined in with um, our sort of church life uh, in different uh, forms and different uh, gatherings and the like. And, um, that's just an amazing testimony to you as a church family. You've been so welcoming and encouraging to people, welcoming folks in and it does mean there's, there's quite a lot of new people in our church family who are still getting to know uh, folks. So lots of ways in which we can um, you know, just welcome people, serve others, uh, be a blessing as we go through this summer uh, season. So let's, um, let's pray. Let's pray for great times, uh, for God to bless us as we uh, reconnect, as we uh, do some of the different things God's calling us into. Um, sorry, lots of information there. I mean, I hope that helps. As I say, do pop things in the diary. Uh, stay safe, uh, take care. God bless.